gonna make something pretty crazy. And by crazy, I mean drawing on a big piece of paper. My standards for crazy are obviously quite low. I'm also gonna be taking some risk here because I'm using fine liners. Ink is an unforgiving medium where one mistake could ruin your entire piece. So let's get started. I started off with a detailed pencil sketch so I don't have to make any decisions while I'm inking. I wanted the theme of this piece to be pretty cozy, you know, in a forest, with a cottage, and most importantly, a hedgehog. Hedgehogs are honestly really fun to draw. This was the second time I've drawn one. The first one was like a year and a half ago and I don't even have the drawing anymore because I had to turn it in for an English project. How that's related to English, I still have no idea. The sketch is done. I actually really like it, except for the house, because I accidentally made it a little, leaning a little bit too far this way. But I don't really feel like redrawing the entire house, because I didn't realize until I was done. So I'm just gonna ink it. I might regret that later, but I don't think it looks too bad. I started off by just outlining everything. I'm gonna go back and make the lines thicker and add some shadows later. This part of the process definitely took the most time, I think it took three hours just to outline everything. Now I usually work very quickly, so that's kind of a lot of time, especially for something like this. But because of the size of the paper, it just felt important. So rather than not thinking about it and just jumping right into the line work, I found myself hesitating on every line. Which is probably why it ate up three hours of my life. And I can't say that time spent really helped either. I think if I had gone a little faster, especially on the lines in the house, it would have looked much cleaner. But I still really like how it turned out. But next time, I'm gonna try to be less scared. I finished the line art and now it's time to make some of the lines thicker, add some shadows, make a lot more details. And you know, one wrong move and the piece is completely ruined. <laughs> I'm fine, this is fine, this is gonna be fine. I at this point, it's a good idea to just step back and take a break, you know, eat some very healthy food. And I promise you, once you come back from a break, you'll look at your piece with a new perspective and you'll be ready to continue. I mean, I certainly was. Those M&Ms gave me energy or something, cause I sped through this part of the drawing like it was nothing. I think it took me an hour for the entire thing. And it ended up looking really good. I actually liked it so much that I put it on a shirt. So if you like the design too, then there's a link in the description. I think it turned out pretty cute. A lot cuter than a lot of my other drawings. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a great rest of your day.